everyone, welcome back. Today I am going to be discussing a very serious topic about the Miss Universe 2021 location, which is going to be Elat, Israel. I hope I said Elat correct. But before we get into all of that, please subscribe and uh, follow me on Instagram if you want to. I've been posting polls and stories in my Instagram the past few days, asking you guys opinions on multiple things. It's helped out so much when it comes to me making these videos. Plus, you guys are so educated on pageantry and it sometimes astounds me the information that you guys are able to contribute to these videos that I didn't already know. So please follow me on Instagram if you are an avid pageant fan especially because it's very helpful to me but yes without further ado let's get into this so the Miss Universe 2021 pageant is being hosted by Israel and is taking place in a southern Israeli city called Elat as you probably know earlier this year Israel was fraught with conflict and was looking more like a war zone than a hospitable country to host Miss Universe in and although Elat is one of the more peaceful cities and is quite a distance away from the locations where most of the conflict took place, I can't help but feel that the Miss Universe organization is playing with fire. There are two factions in this conflict, the Palestinians and the Israeli government, and I won't go into who's right and who's wrong because it's all very subjective and honestly dependent on where you start in history. But it is generally agreed that the Israeli government, being the more powerful and well-equipped force, have done more harm to the Palestinian people that is ethical or necessary. And they have even reportedly enforced regimes that are similar to apartheid on the Palestinian population. And this is where the morality of the Miss South Africa organization comes into question. Because how would they justify supporting a country who would enforce anything even remotely similar to apartheid on its people? And although a ceasefire between the Israeli government and the Palestinian militant group Hamash took place on the 21st of May 2021, I can't help but feel that this is just the conclusion of a small battle in a very big war that has been raging on for decades. It seems like the vast majority of people can agree that the Israeli government have been very unfair and cruel to the Palestinian population and it makes me wonder why the Miss Universe organization would choose to show support to the Israeli government by hosting the pageant in a city that is within Israeli territory. Since physical territory is a huge part of this conflict, I don't understand why this decision was made. Other than the ethical implications of supporting a government that oppresses certain demographics of its population, there is the issue of safety. The safety of these women and the fans coming from all over the world. Like I said, a lot is far away from the centers of the conflict that happened earlier this year and there was a ceasefire. But if someone, anyone, wanted to send a message out to the world, this would probably be one of the best opportunities to do so. The Miss Universe pageant has an average of 500 million viewers each year. I hope the Miss Universe organization is preparing for the possibility of thousands of protesters who could try to make a statement. I don't know yet which of the Miss South Africa 2021 contestants will be appointed to represent South Africa at Miss Universe 2021, but I'm already concerned for her safety, as well as the implications that her participation might have on her personal brand and her career for the foreseeable future. I mean, would you want to be the South African girl who was representing her country in the country that people are claiming is an apartheid state? The Miss South Africa organization hasn't outright its state whether or not they would be sending a candidate to Miss Universe 2021. But if we remember Miss Universe 1984, which was held in Miami, Florida, not even close to South Africa, according to South Africa's representative at Miss Universe that year, Letitia Steyman, there were so many people there protesting apartheid and the security had to do their best to keep those people away from the girls' dressing room and South Africa was subsequently banned from Miss Universe in 1985. For me, this is not so much a matter of who's right and who's wrong, 
but it is a matter of safety. Safety for the contestants competing, safety for the judges, the hosts, the fans, staff members, and everyone else who will be in attendance. Let me know if you think it's a good idea for South Africa to be sending a candidate to Miss Universe 2021. Do you think that the Miss Universe organization was wrong to begin with for deciding to host the pageant in Israel given the recent conflict say? Do you think that concern for safety is a real issue when it comes to this? Please do let me know. I would love to hear your thoughts below. I know this is a very serious topic but it does have serious implications both ethically and when it comes to safety so please let me know what you think and if you haven't already please do subscribe and follow me on instagram thanks so much for watching once again and i will see you in the next one bye